Hello, the kids, it is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of Skyrim. Alright, when we left off, we were trying to figure out what we have to do with this little puzzle here, and it's considering it's only two, we just basically have to play the guessing game. It's not that hard to do. So that was the traps one, okay. That's nice to know. Then, in this case, this is the correct one. Alrighty. Oh. Uh. That looks like something I don't want to kill because that looks like it's Sabretooth Kitty. Run me! Oh, shush. They are friendly. Oh, look at that. That is one gorgeous color there. Holy shit. Let's uh, get away from them before Serana decides she's going to kill them regardless. Where in the hell is Serana anyway? Serana, what the hell are you doing? Come on. Jeez. And noticed a little thing here. Boys in blue. There we are. All right. Head further down the way here. All right. Yeah, there's no need for the uh, night eye now because considering the all the light coming from the rocks, it makes it very hard to see. Anyway, when we left off, I realized I hadn't gotten to that yet. We were continuing on with this little mission that we've been put on to try and kill her father, uh, Harkon. There we go. That's the name. Ta-da. Of course, there's things in our way, such as an... There we go. Such as the need for a certain weapon of lore called Aurel's Bow, which is apparently the weapon of a god by the blood. Oh, you've seen... You've uh, seen what this whole place looks like. Yeah, this is actually rather pretty, considering... You know, it's dank underground, lit by only mushrooms and glowy rocks. But, this is quite a look, a good-looking place. Good lord. Oh, there is quite a few things around that I need to collect. Hmm. I wonder. I have a feeling there's going to be a lot of those things that I don't want Serana killing. So, yeah, I wonder. Can I talk to her about being like... Yeah, no, I can't really do that. I can't talk to her about Ariel's bow, though. Let's do that. What do you know about Not it? Not much. If you read any history, it shows up from time to time, but it's a hard thing to track. Uh-huh. As far as I know, though, it's never been held by a vampire. That would be a new one. Yeah, that probably would be. What does it have to do with the sun? Ariel is one of the elven gods. Mm -hmm. He's with the rest of them in Aetherius. Okay. The way I've heard it, the sun represents the connection from our world to theirs. Uh -huh. Supposedly, the bow draws its energy from the sun itself, which is why it shows up in that prophecy. Ah. Uh, so what does it get? What exactly does it do? In that part, I don't know. Once we have it, hopefully it'll be obvious. Hopefully. Key phrase. All right, well... At this point, now we're just continuing on, trying to get to the end of this cavern here, while also picking up anything that's cool-looking along the way. Alright, up here, we got... Eh, nothing, really. This is pretty much where we came down from, so... The good thing about those poison blooms is it's a good marker of where you've already been. Especially if you're trying to go forward. Take all these uh, gleam blossoms here. I still have not figured out what they're used for. We'll find out soon. Anyway. On our way out. Oop, what? Oh, those are little lighted things. Oh. That's new. Oh, shit, really? I screwed that up. God damn it. God, geez. Can they just stand still? There we are. There we go. Ooh, is that gonna hit? 
Ooh, slow motion kill. Oh yeah. All right. I only I only want to catch a few of those. So those are going those are going to be the only ones I kill. Ugh. I can't speak English today. I apologize. My word salad issue has become very difficult. Veil deer hide. It's the veil deer. That explains the uh, strange looking markings on them. Don't know if those are what's the word evolutionary based or not, but it is pretty nonetheless. Okay, uh, where'd the other one go? Can't have gone too far. Uh, and that popped at some point between uh, our way here and now. Oh, I can get my dwarf and bolt back if I can find where it fucking went. Okay, I must have knocked it around. Oh, well. Let's head over here. There we go. Can't really find the other one, so we'll just leave it as a lost cause for the time being. Okay, can we head up here? I have a feeling there's going to be another one over here. Another one of these. Yep. Run! There we go. Alright, that'll work. And just because it'll mark where I've been. Poison Bloom, thank you. Whoop, okay, I almost fell off. There we go. And <laughs> he'll just sit there looking all, uh, well, vicious, really. Don't think they were designed to have their face uh, not angry. <laughs> so, that's something, anyway. Man, they are pretty, though. I don't, really don't want to kill them if I can avoid it. Oh, poison blooms, so that means we're on the right track. So, I have a feeling that if I didn't grab them before they opened up, they would probably poison me, considering their name. So, it's a good thing I'm grabbing them before they do that. There we are. Alright, I think we've gathered basically everything around here. Here we go. Yep, another way shrine. There we are. So, one out of five. We've got to do that five times? Oh boy. This is going to be a long sort of shit. Hi there. Welcome, Initiate. This is the Way Shrine of Illumination. Is it? Are you prepared to honor the mantras of Ariel and fill your vessel with his enlightenment? Uh, I guess Are you I have no other choice. To honor the there we go. behold Ariel's gift, my child. Uh -huh. May it light your path as you seek tranquility within the inner sanctum. Thank you very much, Prelate. Sidanus? Sidanius? I, I don't know how to pronounce that. That's one hell of a weird... Ah, thank you. Thank you very much. Now I can move forward. Towards the next thingy. But, uh, first I want to collect everything that's on the end here. There we are. Alright. And anything else? These few things. There we go. Uh, yeah, I think that's it. Oh, nope. Ha! Ha ha! Nice try. Thought you could escape me, but no. Alright. Now, draw from the water basin. Yep, this thing's gonna get heavier and heavier the more I do this shit. Now, Forgotten Veil. Serana, so, you ready? Let us go to this Forgotten Veil. Yeah. Now we're getting a close up of her father. Ah! Turn him the other way. Ugh. Ugh. There we go. Now I only have to see his cape. There we go. Alright. Got a couple of these on this side too, which is great. Never hurts to have more of these. Especially because I don't know if I can grow them myself or not. There we are. What we got? Okay. It's a little, quite a little cavern. Before we hit whatever is supposed to be out here, because I hear insects. That means there's open area after this. Oh. Is that a drop I want to make or no? Yeah, I don't think I do. Be go 
going up this wall here. Yep, that is open air. Holy shit. That is... It's like a whole other world. Come on, the bow has to be in this valley somewhere. But can't we just admire this view? This place looks gorgeous. I'm no fan of the sun. Better than this. Would you calm yourself, lady? Okay, there's several markers, which must be the four places I still need to go. And there's a thing up here. What the? What in the world was that? What was that noise? I still don't know what that is. Oh, that's frost troll. Okay. In that case. All right. Let's just throw these. Okay. Put this here. And firebolt there. Okay. Hey, hey! Maybe I guess my guy can tank it there. Oh, he has taken so many hits. More than any other zombie would. Serana, what are you fighting? God! Serana, you fucking psychopath! Jeez. I wanted to keep them alive, thank you. No! Okay. okay. The wrong one. Wrong one. Wrong one. Uh, jeez. Ah, uh, fuck. <sighs> God damn it. You fucking crazy psychopath. You deserve that. So pretty though. Look at them. Look at how pretty they are. Probably more rare than anything else. You have to go and kill every one of them. God damn it. Well, looks like they were already getting killed by everything around here, so. Wasn't that avoidable. Want to help try and conserve them. Damn it. This was crazy. Yeah, and this must be the beautiful anger I have towards you, you crazy bitch. Okay. I'm, I'm a little angry because she killed one of these, and she kind of forced me to kill the other one. Uh, God damn it. Alright, well. No use crying over spilled milk, I guess. Just continue on best as we can. That's all we can do. There are a lot of secrets in this valley that I want to uncover. Because I have not yet done that in a single playthrough. <laughs> On my own. Okay. Okay. Where'd you come from? Uh. Get. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. I will. I will tank for. You. Oh, you goddamn. Oh my god. So I'm gonna have Animal Allegiance on pretty much all the time at this rate. Oh jeez. Good lord. Silver ore mine. I can at least use all the silver that's around this valley. Which reminds me I didn't hit that vein that was over near the last cat massacre that fucking let's get indoors Ron I wanted to do cave. anywhere just out of this can I get you into my sword instead huh I, I actually feel like I want to do that right now uh, this is this is where it's going to drive me batty she is just going to make me ultimately angry because she doesn't listen to directions <laughs> like at all uh, just grab the silver vein that's up here. Just continue on like we should be. There we go. 
check my soda while we do that. There we go. Yeah. One of it almost went down the wrong tube, one of the gulps. Ugh. That does not feel pleasant. But yeah, if you haven't been able to tell already, I've been sick for like the last few days. And so my uh, commentary and brain summarily beaten with the ick stick. I'll leave that one alone. Alright. So. Oh. This one was already killed, I guess, by that uh, saber cat. Oh. Okay. Run In this case. Beat. There we go. Just so we can avoid this one. Gerardo, what in the ever-loving fuck? Okay. Alright. Where is it? Where is the spell? Thank you. Okay. Oh, now you want to have that be your ally, huh? Okay. Okay, now she's pissed me off. You know what? And down you go. How about that, huh? How about that? Did you learn yet? Did you friggin' learn yet? God. Kill this thing. Okay. God damn it. I'm, I'm just not going to be happy with her this entire playthrough. It's not going to happen. It's just not going to happen. Oh, uh, boy. If I can just send her home right now, that would be fantastic, but I don't think I can. Just explore my this valley on my own, that would be great. Fact. Oh, what is it? It's ironic that we're helping these priests. Honestly, I don't think they care what a bunch of vampires would do with Ariel's bow. They're pretty focused on the past. Fair as enough. long as we can get this Verther out of the sanctum, I think they'll be happy to just hand it over. Fair enough. I think we should part ways. And go where? You can't just leave me alone whenever you feel like it. I'm coming with you, like it or not. Yep, that's what I figured. She is going to piss me off this part of the playthrough. And there will be a lot of probably unnecessary rage, but at the same time, it is necessary in my mind. So, just fair warning, this is where I'm going to be cussing her out a lot. Yeah. Uh, yeah, who is there? It's a good question. Run me! Okay, that's not an animal. Palmer. Okay then. Well, now I feel silly for wasting that shout, but at the same time. There we go. That was easy. I'm trying to get her to stop killing saber cats. Damn it. I just want to at least save a few in this valley. God damn it. There we go. I'll just go along with the current quest line. I'll come explore it on my own without her. And it will be easier to keep some of them alive. <sighs> Alright. Where is some of these? I can't really see them on the world map, but I can see them on the mini, on the local map, maybe, I think. Oh, they should show up there. Well, there's the portal to Darkfall. And fill the ewers. Okay, apparently it doesn't show it there either. Great. Fantastic. Well, it does show a little bit on 
the world map, so at least there's that. Alright. Anyway, I have a level up, so I might as well use that now. Uh, shit, which one do I use? Uh, do magic yet for the time being. Alright, and... Where do I put it? Where do I put the perks? Because we're not entirely up on Smithin yet. That would be nice, but we're not there yet. Two-handed. Let's see where, we, where we're at. Deep wounds. We really don't want to put it into that, honestly. And that's pretty much obsolete at this point. This, maybe. Uh, can I go to Adept? I can go to Adept. Alright. That's nice to know, at least. Uh, Impact. We could put it into Impact. Uh, need to wait for that to be at 60. Um, is there anything else I can do with this? Summoner. Oh, wait. This one here. Necromancy. Greater duration for reanimated undead. That's useful. I'd say that's useful enough. Mystic Binding. Bound weapons do more damage. That's eh, not good enough, really. Uh, Dark Souls. Ah, that's a game series. That's <laughs> a game series. <laughs> I, put, I put the plural on the Dark Souls instead of, you know, the series thing. I'm stupid. That's the... Uh, that's the moral of this story right now. I'm fucking stupid. Don't listen to me. Okay. There we are. Now I get it on the first fucking perk. Alright. That means, eventually, I'll be able to do fireballs with much, much less MP cost. Or mana cost. Whatever the fuck we consider it in this game. Uh, my brain is collapsing. I'm being angry at Serana because she keeps killing things that I don't want her to kill. And it's near the end of the episode, so I should end it right now. <laughs> anyway, for watching, click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. Click the like button if you like this particular video. And share in comments so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together, and I will see y'all in the next episode. This has been the one and the only Stray Cat playing games for you.